Spill Some Tea is sponsored by Artillery Tea Company. ArtilleryTeaCO.com is the website. Use the promo code PAYLOAD for 15% off. Artillery Tea is all natural. It's whole leaf. The tea bags are chemical free, and each of them can be used not just once, but twice. Again, the website is ArtilleryTeaCo.com. Artillery Tea Company is family and veteran owned and operated, and a portion of your purchase goes to help veteran and first responder charities. ArtilleryTCO.com. Use the promo code PAYLOAD for 15% off. Uh, Mr. Sam. All right, let's get right into what's in the cup today. You may know the song Dancing Queen by ABBA from weddings and parties, also from Donald Trump's rallies. Well, despite the band's best efforts, you may continue to hear it from Mr. Trump. Here's the headline from the Blaze Media. It reads, ABBA can't keep Trump from digging the Dancing Queen. As we all know, Donald Trump and his campaign like playing Dancing Queen, among other songs, at their rallies. Well, except in a few isolated incidents, the United States allows campaigns to get a political entity's license via the performance rights organization Broadcast Music Incorporated. That's the group responsible for collecting royalties for artists and hosts. It also hosts a giant catalog with the more than 20 million songs. So the case for an artist denying this license over political disagreements is dubious at best. Mr. Trump, for the foreseeable future, can keep dancing to Dancing Queen at his rallies. So we, of course, want to know what you think about all of this as well. You can go to Get On On Rumble. But now, let's bring back in our uh, co-host here. Uh, David, what do you think about all of this? Uh, you know, this is obviously something very interesting, and there's been pushback, if you will, from some artists. But it seems like now they're getting pushback from the very entity that they're pushing back against. Yeah, I know there was Isaac Hayes and uh, his song uh, there that they had to push back. Even the Village People with YMCA, you know, they, they, they had pushed back as well. There's nothing really they can do. Uh, there's not much they can do. Uh, I think Trump's going to be fine on all of that. On a separate note, uh, YMCA was always kind of an interest. There he is, dancing. <laughs> YMCA was always kind of a curious choice. Uh, for you know, I mean, let's look, can we just be honest about it? I mean, I'm not saying it's something that no one isn't thinking because we all know it's kind of like the gay disco 1970s <laughs> theme. I mean, it just is. I mean, we know that, so let's just talk about it. And he's like up there dancing to it, but that's Trump, right? It, it, it kind of just says like everything just makes perfect sense in a way with Trump. It, it bringing back, bringing back the word joy. I mean, it's just joyous. Can't we all share the music? <laughs> That's yeah. right. And can't we all just get along and share the music? There you go. Yeah. All right, guys, we appreciate you guys chiming in on that one. We've got more American Sunrise in just a moment.